heading out into the Cascade Mountains just east of the town of Leavenworth. Our first destination is a campsite near the base of Chumstick Mountain. We're meeting up with some friends who arrived the night prior to campsite we found out here last year. We found the campsite early in the day, but upon arriving almost immediately, we were greeted with a problem. Turns out the previous day's travels had taken a toll on one of the trucks. There's your problem. Who's got a suitable blade? All right, we got suitable blades. It's a suitable like blade. What kind of brand of suitable blade is that? Uh, it's a bench made, bench made bug out. All right, here we go. This I'm going to insert it. Yeah, Green. favorite. Six one. Oh, I can't remember the brand of it. All right. It's a bit Prudential bear. Is that right? Did uh, I do it? I don't think I misreamed. Seems oh, pretty reamed to me. Let's do it one more time for Corey. Yep. Yeah, there you go. Yep. There you go. That that there, there, there we go. That's Good reamed. Yep. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah, then it, it, is it, it in? Yeah, it's in. Then I'll pop it right out real fast. Oh, wow. Look at that. Having sorted out the flat tire with Corey, Joe, and I being extremely helpful throughout the process, we were free to enjoy the stillness of nature always a refreshing and much needed change from our lives in the city. The remainder of the evening was low key we spent it relaxing, enjoying drinks, and swapping stories around the campfire. We'll pick up again tomorrow morning. The next morning, everyone but Christine and I packed up and headed home. We decided to get up early, fly the drone, and get a preview of where we'd be heading later that day. That peak, off in the distance, is Chumstick Mountain. And it's where we're hoping to get to today. It's still a bit early in the year, so snow may be an issue, but hey, there's only one way to find out. The road to get there will lead us up through the forest, on top of a ridge, and then, with any luck, to the top of the mountain. The drive up to the top turned out to be uneventful. That is, until we came across a bit of an obstacle in the form of a three foot tall snowdrift blocking the road. Doesn't look like much on camera, but it was a bit daunting in person. Ultimately though, there were tire tracks going through it, so that encouraged us to give it a go, hoping that maybe the road on the other side would be clear. After crossing the snowdrift again, we decided to stop, enjoy the views, have some lunch, and fly the drone before heading back down to camp for the evening.
In case you're wondering, for dinner tonight is Christine's grilled cheese sandwiches with homemade tomato soup. Yeah, it sounds simple, but it's one of the best things I've ever eaten. It's also one of the first things she ever cooked for me. But now that we're married, she pretty much never makes it anymore. So yeah, it was a good day to be me. The next morning, we got in one final walk before packing up and heading home. Until next time.